Hey guys, Holiday Master here. Uh, today, I'm doing that little review of the comparisons of the Grinch inflatables I own. Um, so, you guys know I did a video of the one with the box, this one, that uh, Lucas gave me. So, again, thank you to him. Um, and then... This is the this one is the one I've had for a few years now. Uh, this was one of Isaiah's original um, five that we've been trying to get for him. Now, again, this video I'm going to do a lot more talking. Sadly, uh, and it'll you'll see why. So today I'm going to compare the two. Uh, Lucas uh, did seal this one in some spots, but it didn't hold. I think he told me he used a different spray than what I used. Um, so it didn't hold as well. This one, if you guys remember, I sadly, a few years ago, I thought it was the best idea to paint it. Because it sealed it and it stood on its own. That, honestly, was one of my worst decisions. And... Then it got to the point where I actually had to take Max off because he was just too thin, even with the paint. Which, again, I regret uh, even doing that, um, taking Max off. Um, so, part of me does feel bad because we're trying to collect Isaiah's original six. And if I seriously, if I didn't paint, or original five, not six, if I didn't paint this guy... I would gladly give it back to Isaiah. I honest to God would. But I have I'm gonna keep this guy because one, I call him my test dummy because he was the first one I painted. I only painted two or three, him being the first, because at the time the Grinch was the one I wanted to save. Uh he he's also the first one I sprayed with Flex Seal out of all the few I've sprayed, about 15 I've sprayed with Flex Seal. This is the only, or this was the first one. This is the one that gave me the idea to do it, just to save it. Now, therefore, I've only sprayed his head and his legs. Um, yeah, only his head and legs, because that's all I had enough to spray. And he stands up. He doesn't stand up on his own. You gotta kind of give him a little tug. Uh, but with the strings, he does come up. Now, the reason I didn't spray anything else yet is, one, I didn't have enough at the time. Two, I was happy he was just standing. And three, the red paint on his back is coming off. So I'm going to try and let all, you know, the paint come off and then spray it. Uh, so this is, I'm keeping this one. And it's, I do use it. It's not like I, you know, he's my test dummy and he only stays in the basement. I actually use this one. So, although it doesn't look that good because it's been painted and everything, most people don't even tell. He usually stands in the back of my display, which this coming season he probably will too. Um, so, yeah, I actually do use them. Then this one, I told Isaiah, I will flex seal, and I will be happy to give it to him, just so he has one of his original... Uh, Five. And if you guys are wondering what the original five are, go check out our channel. I'll put a link in the description down below. Uh, there, It's not the best video. It's from 2008, I think. Uh, Isaiah posted it. And you can see 12-foot Santa in the yard, and then the other four on the porch. Carousel, this Grinch. Uh, Santa in a present, which if you guys check that video out actually i'll just put that one in the description down below um i think it's by arrow motions i actually used to have it too but i never got to do a video on it because when i got mine it was from a family member and it was in their shed that you know mice and rats have chewed through and it smelled like cat pee and if it wasn't thin i would have kept it and cleaned it but it was, it was in horrible, horrible condition. Uh, so I just took the fans off of it and um, 
threw it away, which I told Isaiah, I said, if I wish, I wish I would have known it was the same one and I would have kept it, you know, and cleaned it up and fixed it. Uh, so yeah, you guys will see in the video. And then the 2001 Hugging Snowman, which I have a friend of mine who might sell me his. I just need, you know, I got to collect the money to do that. Uh, or Isaiah and I might go together to get it. So those are the original five Isaiah had. Um, again, you can see them in that video. Again, sorry, not the best video. It was 2008, I think, with a digital recorder. Uh, but anyway, so I told him after I fixed this guy up, I will more than be happy, you know, be happy more than anything to give it to him because I have this one, which I'm happy to have this one, even if it's not in the best shape. Um, now, this fan is smaller than this one originally. This one doesn't have the original fan on it. That one does. So I'm thinking when I spray it, I'll give it a 04 model fan just to give it that boost. Um, not 04 model. What am I saying? The, like this one has the little, like little end where the air comes out. I mean, I mean something like this. If I can, if I can get it here. Something like this, guys. Just without the tube part. Which I don't know what year that's from, but anyway. And the reason I'm giving this one to Isaiah is a little funny story. And like I said, I'm sorry this video's this long and then I'm talking a lot. Um, actually, let me check to make sure it's still rolling because I sometimes my phone... Ah, oh, perfect. It is still rolling. Okay. Anyway, so this is kind of a shout out uh, to another YouTuber um, I've become friends with. And he's actually a really nice and chill guy. Uh, Chase, the inflatable god. He has a Grinch also for me. Uh, I'm going to buy it off of him. Well, he said it's free, but shipping and whatnot. So whatever it takes, even if I have to buy it off of him, I'm going to do it. Um, so shout out to Chase, the inflatable god. He's going to give me another one. And the one he gives me, he sent me a picture. It's not as bad as this one. But it's still wore out. Um, so it's going to need fixed too. But I'm going to use both Grinches. Because one has Max and one doesn't. I guess you could say that's my version of having the 04 one and the 01 or 02 I think. Where the Grinch is like this, not this. Um, but anyway, off topic. Um, and actually, Chase and I just did a trade. I gave him two of my blow-ups, which if he does videos on them, you guys will see what two I gave him. And he gave me, well, the Grinch I have to get from him around Christmas time, like November-ish, uh, because he said it's in the back of his shed or he can't get to it or something, which I'm fine with. He gave me eight-foot SpongeBob on a present, Moose Family, four-foot Snoopy, and a four-foot Snowman. I think those are the ones. Yeah, those are the ones. Um, so it was a win-win for me because, again, I have this one, given this one to Isaiah, and then the one Chase is giving me, I'm going to keep and actually use in my display too. Um, so yeah. Uh, now, when I did the video on this guy, I had the Wind World Globe fan, and I had it soaked down, and it still was barely standing. Uh, you guys will get to see in this video, this thing does not do much. Um, and that's kind of the purpose of this video, was to compare the two, which I thought would be neat to do. Plus, it, it was an opening to let me explain pretty much the backstories, uh, to give Chase a shout out. So, it was kind of, you know, perfect timing, if you should say. Um, so, yeah, I guess without further ado, I'll plug them in and you'll see the difference, big time. This one, I actually have to hold the fan down or else it tips. 
Sometimes he pushes up, sometimes he doesn't. Now I'll help. So, uh, yeah, guys, that's it. That's all the further he comes up. Um, and the air, the fan is getting perfect suction. It's just that thin. So, uh, like I said, I'm happy Lucas gave me this one because it gives me a second chance to, you know, fix it. Um, and again, this one, I'll admit. I regret painting it. I really honestly do. Because I'll be honest with you guys, this one over here that's standing, I think he looks like crap. And it's because I painted him. But he's still the Grinch. That's why I don't care. Um, the only other thing I did, uh, you guys may see like this one has the divider in the middle. I cut the divider out of that one. And the reason I did that was, instead of having it like fold, because it would fall over, after I cut the middle, he started standing on his own, back before I painted him. So, at the time I thought, okay, you know. So, um, yeah. But I will try to stand him up best I can as a chair here. To uh, <laughs> show them side by side, kind of. So, uh, yeah, guys, <laughs> there it is. Sorry, it's not the best. Um, so, yeah. And, I mean, he just collapses. But, um, I guess I could turn the lights out real quick. Um, so yeah, like I said, I mean, you can see how thin this thing really is. It's one of the reasons Lucas gave it to me, which again, I'm thankful for. He's just, where's that light? He's just see-through pretty much. <laughs> I didn't even get to look at Max yet. All the lights are out of him. I guess that's all I can get him to stand. Even he's still sinking. But anyway, like I said, I don't like it because the paint came off. And like I said, in the back here, it's coming off. Which, um, it is thin there and the air is rushing out of there. But I'm trying to let it, you know, come off the rest of the way before I spray it. But I see it this way. Looks are one thing, but the outcome is another so like look you can actually push on him and he comes back up that one you can't so I've learned from my mistakes not to paint inflatables and I, again that's why I call this one my test dummy because I learned not to do that I also learned flex seal works with this guy and I'm honestly going to keep this one going as long as I can and then again fix this one up for isaiah and then whenever i get the one from chase um i'll keep that one so uh yeah guys thanks for watching and peace out